Do you think Dasher would like these boots? Do I think Dasher would like what, Steven? I... Uh... Sorry. Whatever. I wanted to know if you thought Dasher would like these boots. I thought Dasher didn't want any combat gear. But these are just boots. It's not like he has to kick people with them. He could just wear them. Oh, 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 yeah? Oh, can he wear them? Human style? <laughs> uh, well, he is a human, so yes? <laughs> he said it! Flex! Where's your face? I hate this. What? I can't shake the feeling that something is wrong around here. I know what you mean. I don't like doubting Dasher. He's always been really adamant about trying to see the good in everybody. But that attitude keeps getting us in trouble. He got lucky with Krog, but Jim and Kasher nearly destroyed us when we let our guard down. I wouldn't say he got lucky with Krog. And not just because the phrasing makes me feel weird. He found the right words to say, and he appealed to Krog's better nature. Tasha may not be the smartest, but he's good at reaching people emotionally. You should give him more credit. Not everybody can be reasoned with, though. True, but that's no reason not to try. So then I was like, oh, well, can I wear the human style? And, and then he started crying. And all the shopkeepers applauded. Really? The shopkeepers? Would you two shut up? They're gonna hear us. Go. Oh, hey you two! Dolan, wait! What's with them? I, I don't know. We were having a great time, but they suddenly wanted to leave. They were laughing at us. Well, we were dancing. Oh. Hey, hey you! Where you going? Thank you again for your hospitality, but we really must be- You can't leave yet. There's so much stuff left to buy, I mean see. Yeah, our favorite human program is about to start. You gotta see that! Yeah, come on! Please! Fine. Desher, I'm not comfortable with this. Yeah, I'm having second thoughts, too. But I want to talk to them about it before we go. Maybe it's just a misunderstanding. Let's watch their favorite show, and then we'll get this all sorted out. What are those?! They're simply the most beautiful things my weak human eyes have ever seen! I see you've noticed my double pockets! They're pockets for your pockets! For that authentic human style! Human approved. Uh, yeah, we don't do that! Humans don't do that! Especially beloved by ancient balding humans in really tacky, ugly jackets! Wow! Golly gee! Do you think I'll ever be as cool as you? <laughs> no. Cool. So not only is it a bad invention, but they gotta be douchebags about it too? <laughs> <laughs> I've seen enough. Wait, before we go, I wanna ask. 
Why were you watching us? Watching you? Well, uh, like... We wanted to make sure you didn't take or break anything, you know? <laughs> okay, fair. Then why were you laughing? But laughing? Oh, uh, you see, uh, Jonka here just told a hilarious joke, didn't you, Jum? Oh, uh, yeah. Let's see here. Why did the humans, I mean, uh, some other species, uh, do something embarrassing? Why? Because they're humans! <laughs> oh, crap. What's with you and your anti-human stuff? What's with us? What's with you? Oh, boy. They're all fake! Solograms. Solid holograms. That explains why they don't move. Or blink. That's why I lost that staring contest! It's not our fault you weren't involved enough to notice. Can we leave now? Yes. <sighs> Thank God. Dasher, you coming? Why? Why would you go through all the trouble just to build this human hate park? Us? This is your fault! How in the hell is this our fault in any way? Little Gaia used to be a great place, filled to the brim with customers and real-life shopkeepers even. But then you humans showed up. We welcomed you with open arms and your kind ridiculed us. You made us feel like fools. After those humans said what they did, people stopped coming around and all our co-workers left too. Now it's just us. And there's no way we're gonna let you make fools of us again. So now you're the fools! Ha <laughs> ha! You've gotta be fucking kidding me. First of all, there are five billion of us on Gaia alone. Who knows how many humans are roaming the stars? You're going to write off billions of people over a bad experience with a handful of us? I don't mean to downplay what you went through. You guys put a lot of effort into this place, and it shows. I think Little Guy is great. It's done a lot to calm my nerves about being so far from home. It was completely uncalled for for those people to make fun of you for it. But it's just as uncalled for for you to blame the entire human race for the actions of a few of us. You're using your bad experience with us as, like, it's some kind of bartering tool. Like, if we don't do everything you say, and give you everything we have, your perspective on humans will be ruined forever. It's not fair. I will agree. Not all humans are nice, and not all humans are smart either. Hell, I'm not very smart. I can admit that. But every human being, every living thing, deserves your respect and decency. Until they've proven that they don't, or if they refuse to treat you the same way. We've done nothing to you. So why do this to us? Can't you see that what you're doing is wrong? 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 Who are you to tell me what's right and what's wrong? Am I not allowed to have opinions? What you have isn't an opinion, it's a misconception. Hit it, Four Eyes! I'll show you a misconception! Knock it off, Lex. They're right. You know they are. I'm sorry, I... that we... well... We understand. Yeah, and we appreciate the apology. You know that speech you gave? Yeah? I think you're smarter than you give yourself credit for. Oh, thank you. Would you two look at yourselves? That blockhead gives one teary-eyed speech and suddenly you're all on their side? Need I remind you that these exact humans came to little guy with the same misconception we have? You four immediately assumed we were trying to mess with you just because some other guys were. How is that? Fair. I... Aw, oh, crud. No, that wasn't fair of us. We apologize. Shut up! I don't want your stinking apology! I want you to admit I was right! Look, we don't want any trouble. So if you'll excuse us, we'll take our business elsewhere.
I'm sorry. I know you're mad at me. I'm not mad. Dude, I've known you for like 12 years. I can tell when you're mad. I'm sorry, but I don't like that you hurt that guy. It didn't change anything. He went in thinking humans were bad, and he left thinking the same thing. Maybe worse. He got what he deserved. You assaulted him! I defended you! Yeah, you did. As much as I hate violence, I do appreciate not being stabbed again. If you want my opinion on it, things did change. He went in thinking humans were weak and ignorant. And he left knowing that you can't pick on somebody and go unpunished. It's karma. He put out bad energy and he got it back. I still believe there's a better way. But thank you for protecting me.